never I, t- I took some advice from um one of one of steven's friends actually uh they did this video oh my word what 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 was that horse what was that you okay huh uh, I took some advice. You should never dread your closet. You should never look at stuff in your closet and be and dread putting it on because if you do that and there's stuff in your closet that you never wear, then you don't feel good about yourself. So always have stuff in your closet that you want to wear. <laughs> uh, okay, I don't need to actually read your dialogue because I hate it. That is forever away. Do you realize how far away that is? You stupid Korok. I hate you. We are going the opposite direction. Um, mm. Okay, okay, okay. I have an idea. I have an idea. I'm going to mark this guy. And then I'm going to do this quest. And then on my way back, I will stop here. I will do it. And then I can warp back to the stable and get my horse. That is the proper pathing for that to make that as not miserable. Enjoyable? Enjoyable as possible. Speaking of Koroks, yep. Every bridge has a Korok. It's just, that's just a fact. There's nothing you can do to argue that fact. And I am going to get all the Koroks in this stupid game. I'm gonna do it. Why? Because I have a problem. A problem that nothing can fix. A hyperfixation on Hope maybe the reward for all of this malarkey being worth it. Where you you are a man who has legs and you are everywhere. I don't want to hit my horse. Horse, can you not? There we go. I don't understand how you are everywhere, but you somehow managed to be everywhere. And I wish I could be like you, but I can't. Not all of us can be like you. You're everywhere dedicating your life to that man. That mus mustachioed, bull-cut man. And I'm not as strong as you, okay? I'm just not. Can you give me some of your strength and your balls, please? Try letting go. That did not work. You know what? That's not what. <laughs> That's not what. <laughs> that wasn't what. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to take a, a cue from this guy's incredible strength and fortitude. He's an inspiration to us all of his indomitable will to make the best out of what is a terrible situation. Let go. It will be fine. Yes, it's fine. Do it, bro. I wish I could just give him all these stakes. Do you have any idea? as I talk over this black screen that I normally cut out, how happy he would be to get the stakes that I have. And not just the stakes, oh my word. <laughs> I went to take out a steak and I accidentally took out a steak. <laughs> that wasn't even intentional. That was a visual pun. Am I, am I stronger than I thought? I might be stronger than I thought. I might be as strong as him actually. I think I'm actually the strongest man ever. I mean, I'm getting all the Korok, so clearly there's some strength here that is untapped. It's like, I'm like Gohan. I'm basically Gohan. I don't know what I'm talking about. Something in this island has made me crazy. I was really hoping my horse would fly over that. This is probably what I'm looking for, right? The pain! One sec. What? <laughs> Oh, help, please. Princess Zell, her recipe as written. Don't uh, improvise. Where is this recipe? Are they? Oh, wait, it's right here. They're all dying. Who suggested? Who said monster meat? Oh, uh. Oh, I think animal mean, right? Maybe uh, first, uh, first rule of cooking: always follow the uh, recipe. These guys tried to cook monster meat. 
<clears throat> Princess Zelda's meat and rice bowl. That's the recipe? Combi combine plain raw meat, Hylian rice, and rock salt. Do I have Hylian rice? This flavorful, sorry, this flavorful comforting dish is sure to fill you with energy, but be sure to follow the recipe to the letter. Yeah, I have a Zelda impression. What of it? Uh, <laughs> uh, rice, 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 rice. And that's not a recipe I can like follow, right? Hyrule herb. Do I have rice? I have salt. I don't think I have rice. Um, hmm. Where do I? Hylian rice. Hold on. There's no way I don't have Hylian rice. Sunday lion. It would be right here. So I guess I need to go cut some grass, I guess. Um, there's a field over here. Horse, I'm not trying to kill you. Restless crickets. Please give me some rice. Oh, I need you. Ah. I need hightail lizards for my gear. Give me the lizard. Okay. I need rice, though. Ah, they're so fast. Where on earth? This is how I get rice, right? Maybe I need to cut something specific. Maybe I need to cut this. This is not good. Unless there's rice here. Oh yeah, rice grows. Oopsie. Rice grows in um in the water, doesn't it? This rice? Come on. Give me the rice. Please. I'm desperately, I'm just a crazy man cutting grass in the water. Desperate. A desperate man looking for rice. You know rice is the most eaten food on the planet? Isn't that crazy? It's like most of the food we eat. I mean, rice is good. Rice is like the best food. Is it not the best food? Is it actually the, like, regardless of the the numbers, right? Because the numbers, they the numbers don't lie. We know the numbers. The results are in. The people don't lie. Uh, is rice just the best food on the planet? Because, like, think of all the stuff it goes with. It's not like... I never think, ah, man, I want some rice. But I, I'm always happy to have it. And for that reason, it's just, like, the tried and true greatest of all time. Where on earth is Hylian rice? Am I... What am I... What am I doing? What am I doing with my life? I need the rice. How do I not have rice? Hello? Okay, so that's the icon. Do I have it? Do I have that icon? How on earth am I alive without having that icon? It should be right in here. And it's not. And I'm angry. I'm hangry for rice that I'm not even going to be able to eat because I'm feeding these poor buffoons that poison themselves by trying to th eat bokoblins. What's wrong with them? I need rice. I also needed a lizard, but unfortunately, no, no lizard for me. What is going wrong? Those are tomatoes. I don't need no tomatoes. I don't need a Korok seed. I don't need poop. Poop is how they got in this mess. They probably ate a Korok seed and are on their deathbed. I don't need tomatoes. I've never seen them the entire game, but they're all right here. This is where all the tomatoes on the planet are. If I cut this, do I get it? No. Come on, horse. We're going back. We're going to an open clearing so I can cut grass, so we can get rice, so that we can, we can heal these people with Zelda's secret recipe that is actually just a normal rice ball. Come on, back to the fields. Okay, certainly this has it. Okay, I'm gonna bank on something. 
I'm going to perform a trust fall into Beetle, into the game designers to say that they probably gave Beetle rice to sell. Please. Please. Give me rice. Yes! Thank you, games. Thank you, devs. I love you. Sometimes. Except for all the times when I don't. I'm also going to buy it, actually. These. 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 That's... I need arrows. Okay. All right. Back to the thing. We finally have our rice. I don't remember what else was in the recipe, but certainly we have it, right? Can I take the dog? I want the dog. The dog. You know, I'm, I would just feed them to the dog. I would make rice balls out of them and give them to the dog. Because honestly, they are more trouble than they are worth. Okay. Sup, guys. Welcome. It's me. Okay, meat and rice bowl, uh, raw meat, hyaline rice, and rock salt. That's all it is. You worthless <laughs> cretins. <sighs> That's actually a really good recipe. Wow. Hello. Yes, here it, here it is. Eat it up. Huh? That smell. Hey, hey you, you. Yeah, yeah, you. Can I have that meat and rice bowl? Please, please, I need to eat it. Yeah, I made it for you. Um, be thankful that I didn't make <laughs> make you it into it. You know, words. This, I recognize this flavor. Haha, <laughs> this is the recipe Princess Zelda shared with us. You know, salt, rice, and meat. Wow. Jute, Telly, Endai. What kind of names are those? Hurry up and take a bite of this. This rice. It's the best thing we've ever had. This rice. Thank you for helping us. We were not doing all that well at all. Princess Zelda taught us how to cook the rice <laughs> quite some time ago. We ran into her once during our travels. She was full of kindness for us, despite our group looking a little ragged along the road. But I do remember now that she said she needed to follow that we need to follow the recipe exactly. Huh? Whose bright idea was it to substitute monster parts in place of real meat? Uh, that was me. Sorry, I just was just curious what it would taste like. I thought maybe her recipe would work well with the monster parts. The road to gourmet greatness is littered with stuff you wouldn't think is tasty. You've got to expand your palate. Now's not the time to sit and figure out the best practices for future dietary exploits. We've got to get to, ri to Riverside Stable. We're so late, I'm sure Goddard's been worrying about us. We really are great for grateful for your help. Let me say again, on behalf of everyone, thank you. You don't even know us, but you used valuable ingredients. You got rice, salt, and... You know what? The rice was rare. That's fair. <clears throat> Here, take this. <laughs> Here... <clears throat> if you guys so much as mention the word rice to me again, I'll show you what human rice and salt makes. Alright? <laughs> I'm giving you a five minute head start. Well, if it isn't my partner. Hi. Any luck finding those missing travelers yet? I just started to scout for them from the sky when I saw you down here. You chasing down any leads at all? I did, in fact. In fact, would you kindly scout ahead and see where they ran off to? What? They were right here, too. Queasy to even, too queasy to even move? And you helped them get on their feet again? And they laughed at you for it? Interesting. So the Charps and Warbles were really onto something. I'm impressed that Princess Zelda's vast knowledge includes things I wouldn't expect, like how to cook rice. She really is a dastardly one, isn't she? We've worked together to chase four of the stories relating to Princess Zelda. Go on and add this to your nesting, partner. Sick. And just one more thing. Tracy sent along a bonus for all our hard work. The froggy sleeve! Oh, we don't need to go back! Sick! A good sleeve for a rainy day. Small dimples on the fingers act as suction cups, giving good grip on wet, slippery surfaces. Ah. It's pretty rare gear that'll help... It'll make it easier to keep your grip on walls, even on rainy days. It's not a pair of wings, but I'm sure it'll help you to reach new heights, partner. A recipe from Princess Zelda, perfect for getting folks into fighting shape. Ah, uh, the article almost writes itself. Almost. Except for the angle that she was the one who poisoned them herself by giving her them a recipe for monster parts. Suck ball! Suck ball! So long! <laughs> 
All right. <laughs> Onward, Onward we go. Uh, did I see something this way or am I crazy? I forget. I was kind of seeing red for a little bit there. I don't think there is. Oh, it was that. It was the Korok. Uh, I'll see if I can find it real quick. 